yo, yo, another day, another adventure with your homeboy Jermaine and getting this vlog started off. Leaving Romania, I'm headed to Bulgaria and oh my gosh, this morning, I was supposed to be at the bus session at 10 a.m. And what happened was I left the hostel at like 9.15 and the traffic was like insane. So the Uber driver was driving me and we actually missed the bus. So I just went in to, to just ask, hey, has the bus already left? Because I showed up like eight minutes after nine. The guy from the bus station called the bus driver and told him to wait. And then I jumped into like a taxi and the taxi caught up with the bus and I was able to catch the bus. How insane was that? Like I'm actually really, really stoked. I really just wanted to get out of here. I didn't want to have to wait 12 hours or 11 hours for the next bus. And I didn't want to have to pay extra and then take a train. So everything ended up working out great. So we, we're on a little pit stop right now. I didn't want to vlog earlier because my heart was just racing. And yeah, I'm glad that I'm getting ready to take off another day, another adventure. Anyway, yo, let's get this video started. So right now I'm taking the flex bus and wow, this bus is actually really nice and really comfortable. It definitely beats the train ride because the train ride was just really, really hot. If it wasn't so hot on the train, it wouldn't be as bad but I'm, I'm really glad the bus is nice and comfortable. This is about a seven hour journey. It cost about $20. There was an option I could have taken a train. Trains are usually more comfortable than a bus, but the train was like $25. And instead of a seven hour bus ride, the train took, I think nine hours or nine and a half hours or close to 10 hours. So I thought, yo, the bus is cheaper. The bus is faster and the bus is not bad. It's pretty comfortable. So let's get back on the bus and keep going. Put some gas on there. Okay, looks like we are about to cross over into Bulgaria right here. We, this is a very, very short, short commute here. adventure takes all right welcome to bulgaria um just went through the passport control and that was really really easy no questions asked the bus driver came took our passports took them over to the passport control they stamped us out of romania stamped us into bulgaria and then the bus driver came and gave us our passports back it was super simple super easy yeah let's keep this adventure going Okay, quick little pit stop here in this little town. I don't know the name of this. This is like a five minute break. Lots of taxis at this bus stop. And it looks like we have another two hours left to go before we arrive to Sofia. It's pretty cool. All right, finally off the bus. New city, new country. Oh yeah, let's touch the ground. Ah, uh, there we go. All right, this is the central bus station and that looks like a different language. <laughs> now, one of the first things I've noticed around here is I see quite a few casinos. I think I've counted a handful of casinos just, just before I got off the bus there as we're driving, driving through. So these are the streets of Sophia. Fia. Oh, first impressions. This place looks like a really cool, really cool town. It's very chilled and relaxed. People are friendly. Yeah. First impressions. Ok, 
okay looks like my hostel is just right down the street here and this place seems to be pretty chill now when I was in Bucharest one thing I noticed that well I got a lot of stairs in Bucharest like a lot of stairs one reason why I really didn't vlog that much there well that's a pretty big dog yeah one reason why I didn't vlog that much in Bucharest and here it seems to be very relaxed like I don't feel like an alien walking around here like I did in Bucharest this place is pretty cool so far oh check out this cool looking building this cool modern looking building with underground parking garage I like those colors looks brand new and modern I'm a huge fan of modern design that looks pretty cool so it looks like I have about four more blocks to go and I'll be at the backpackers something I forget the name of it all right just checked into this hostel not bad not bad this room is about twenty dollars a night pretty decent yeah pretty decent pretty chill okay let's do a quick internet speed test really fast see what the internet's all all about here and this is the download speed oh man not bad not bad at all wow these eastern european countries has really very good internet i must admit i mean much faster than most places in the u.s and there's the upload speed no problems here <laughs> definitely no problems here wow check out these streets looks pretty cool i need to go look for some uh local currency so money exchange so let's go on a adventure looking for some currency exchange oh snap what's going on here Alright, let's look for this currency exchange. Okay, back at the hostel here and I got some Bulgarian money. I wish this place would accept credit cards, that way I wouldn't have to exchange for the local currency, but it's nice to have a local currency. It, you know, it, I can keep one of these for a souvenir. I believe the currency is like 1 to 95 or something, so this is pretty close to $10. So, uh... I think I'm gonna wrap this video up. This has been pretty long. But anyway, stay tuned for tomorrow's video. I'll probably be roaming around doing some unusual stuff in Sofia. So anyway, thanks a lot for watching. Peace out, yo. Another day, another adventure, another day, another country, yo.